Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome back to the channel, Dan vs Food. So this morning, I've just got my, my morning coffee from Yolo's Cafe. It's literally just around the corner there. It's really, really good coffee actually. Well, I've got an iced Americano. It's like 50, so just over a dollar or something like that. It's pretty strong as well. So today, what are we gonna do? We're gonna uh, go for a little walk, wander around, explore around. Dongle, I can't remember the name of the, the area. Um, I'll put it on the screen. <laughs> uh, we're gonna have a wander around and uh, just check out this little district actually. But there seems to be like just some really cool, quirky little places around here. Like, I don't know what that is, Seasun? Is that a cafe? Let's just check. There seems to be a lot of, no, 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 it's not. It's like, um, I'm not sure. Sun products, body products. <laughs> yeah, see, Sun Cafe. No, Dad. Yeah, this area seems pretty nice. Oh, look. nice cream. Gelato bubble waffle. And this morning is actually like pretty not too hot. It's, uh, I think it's about 20. No, no, it is. It's 30 something. 30, 31. It's a little bit overcast. But, uh, not too hot yeah it's not like incredibly hot i've only been out for five minutes though so it's just after the dragon boat festival now and even throughout the dragon boat festival it was quite quiet yeah obviously everything was closed but now it sort of seems like most things are still kind of closed i'm not sure why i'm getting the impression that Taiwan likes to start the day later and end the day later which is different actually it's different for for an Asian country I, like in Southeast Asia Vietnam and, and Thailand they're up at like four in the morning even earlier at the market and done all their shopping for the day by 5 a.m. because it's just generally too hot in the day but it seems like 90% of places in Taipei open like 11 or 12 like midday not all obviously but but some some there's a cool hat shop there it does say open it doesn't look open though look 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 this is a look Logusta. Friday to Saturday open 1 a.m. close 11 p.m. do you see what I mean it's like I don't know it's so different to what I'm used to. <laughs> 11 p.m. close to, to buy some clothes. There's a GoPro shop here, but it's closed. Okay, it opens at 12 and uh, closes at 10 p.m. So, oh, 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 hero black 11, if only. And you know what I've noticed on my first few days here? There are no bins around Taipei, okay? I think they've taken the same approach as Ta uh, Ta uh, Japan, yeah? Uh, because it's really clean here. It's very similar to like Tokyo in its cleanliness. So yeah, like no bins, no rubbish, yeah, no garbage. Right, so I've just actually popped back to my, um, my accommodation to use a bin. <laughs> and I just freshened up quickly as well. That's the name of where we are, okay. How did I do? Passion fruit, bananas, avocados, melon. Look at those watermelons in there, they are huge. She's going to weigh it. She is going to weigh this enormous watermelon. Yeah, up. Yeah, Whoa. One, two, three. Okay. 16.380. Sometimes 20, yeah? Oh, wow, that's amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What I really, really like about Taipei as well is you've got this contrast of like new skyscraper, shiny buildings, and then they still got this, like, they've got these old style, like older, more traditional style buildings as well. Um, whereas, like, Tokyo, it's all brand spanking brand new shiny buildings you know but uh, here they've still managed to keep hold of the the traditional buildings uh, it's still really really quiet you know 
We're, we're right in the center of Taipei and it's past 11 now. Things should be open, but listen, look, just listen. And the cars are practically silent. Oh, it looks like a betting shop. I think it's a Taiwanese betting shop for the uh, lottery there. And you can use my card. And the my card to do that. Should I put a bet on? Some random thing, not knowing what I'm betting on. Maybe no. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. What's this? Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 English. So, say again. Chong Yo Bing. Chong Yo Bing. Oh, it's over there. Oh, it's like a pancake, yeah? Oh, awesome. And this? Yo Tiao. Yo Tiao. It's really big. I'm yeah. not quite that hungry at the moment. <laughs> um, I might come back later. Okay. Yeah, check it, the size of it out. That is enormous, right? And it's really thick as well. Okay, so I'm going for a non sweet fresh soy milk let's um let's open that up oh it's hot it's hot oh wow yeah 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 that's perfect actually oh, thank you. so it is hot but that's all good because if it's hot it means it's fresh so <sighs> fresh soy milk oh yeah and god damn it that is very very fresh Delicious. Mm. Ah, please, please, please don't rain. Let's go down this random alley. See what's down here. Probably not a lot, but then you never know. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, not much going on down here. Not much at all. <laughs> Believe in yourself and follow your dreams. Oh, it's just starting to rain. I was just chilling on that bench there, admiring the view of this awesome structure, Taipei 101. And I'm doing a bit of research on it because I don't really know that much about skyscrapers in different cities around the world. Um, uh, yeah, from 2004 to 2009, it was the tallest building in the world. It's 508 meters high. Oh my God, that's huge. Yeah, it does completely dominate the skyline here in Taipei. Oh, um, yeah, I didn't mention the amount of floors that Taipei 101 has, but do I really have to? Ni hao. Hello. Hey. Hi, uh, how are you? Hey. Oh, they duck noodle soup, duck rice, and some side dishes of pork belly, sweet liver, um, dried flour, tofu, spicy chicken rice. It looks, looks like a pretty good place, right? Check it out. I like places like this. They, they, they usually have the best food. Uh, she's, uh, she's just coming over because they have these kind of mark off it's in Chinese. Chinese oh, oh no. No, no oh I can't yeah sorry I can't can I have chicken duck winter powder oh, okay duck winter powder okay and yeah and one <laughs> she's looking at me like why do you want that why are you ordering that um, and oh no I'm gonna go for the sweet liver sweet liver okay. yeah okay okay all right I've been uh, granted permission to come in the kitchen he was pointing like come in come in Ah, oh, bean sprouts in the noodle. Oh, it's like a vermicelli noodle. Oh, wow. What's the difference between these broths? There's one, two, three. I don't know how they've done it, but this is air conditioned in here. But it's like outside. I don't, I don't quite get that. But he's sweating. It's hot, right? Hot, hot. Hot, hot. <laughs> oh, there's the duck. So I'm getting the duck soup. That's, that's what it is. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's go and sit down. Oh, mm -hmm. oh yeah. Oh, the lighting in here is a little bit, a little bit flickery. I can't seem to get that off as well. Oh no. Okay. Oh, that looks seriously good. Wow, wow, 
like marinated in probably a soy sauce, ginger, more spring onion. It's like liver cake. Mm. That's so leading good in my way. It's very kind of chewy on the outside. And then it, ha it doesn't actually have that like liver texture inside of it. It, it doesn't. I'm not sure what they've done to it so to make it like that. Really good with the ginger. Again, it's a, it's a, just a nice, quite simple dish, right? I think there's like four ingredients in this. Oh, I'm not sure about the sauce. I'm counting the sauce as one. Super delicious. Really healthy. Love it. Best duck soup in Taiwan. Mm. Yeah, I think it's like a chicken broth. I'm pretty sure of it. Um, damn, there's duck meat inside the chicken broth, and that looks like chicken as well, doesn't it? Is this chicken or is that duck? What do you think? No, that black black. It's a hundred percent chicken. This a quack 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 quack. Yeah yeah. Yeah. Ah uh, no quack 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 quack. No no this is quack quack quack. This is quack 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 quack. Uh, yeah, yeah. Is it? Oh wow. Oh okay okay okay. Chit chit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, okay. She's my battery just ran out. Just as the uh, lady gave me this, she was like, "Very good, very good." Hmm. It looks like some kind of root vegetable and chili. Mm. Oh yeah. <laughs> Now let's try it. Mm. Whoa, good, really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it. Very spicy, but good spicy. Let's try the noodle. Oh, and she brought over the chicken as well. This year, this year. Yeah, they just brought me over some like. Um, boiled chicken with bean sprouts so yeah we'll come to that in a minute mm. Mm. I do love that much honey. that's seriously good so that was quite funny we were just taking the thumbnail photo and um, yeah she was holding the chicken and then she she poured the chicken juices, all the chicken juices, like all over my arm. She's just like cracking up. <laughs> oh well. So let's try this chicken now. It looks like just pure chicken breast. And look, look how juicy that is. Ah oh, yes, I love it already. A bit of spring onion, a couple of bean sprouts. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to use the word mush, but I swear to God that basically dissolved in my mouth. I'm not even joking. I, I uh, no. <laughs> She's brought me over um, a chicken soup as well. I think it's just a chicken and chicken and vegetable. Um, wow, she's a feeder. She really is a feeder. Bringing over extra chicken, chicken soup. Oh, 
Oh my god, is that all ginger in there? That is ginger and just like, looks like greens. Proper, like, spinach greens. Tasting. Mm. The more the chicken. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, so smashed oh. all of that. Absolutely That's delicious. Oh, uh, that's safe. Subaba, very Subaba. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my word, it's so full, very, very full. But what? What's this? You are pointing at this. What's this? Yeah. Uh, okay. okay. Any of you beautiful people out there can kindly translate this for me, um, and maybe these. By two. By two. By two. Oh. Ah, okay. Thank you. She <laughs> said. Yeah, if you could translate that, I'm sure one of you can. That would be awesome. Okay. What a beautiful little place this is. I would highly recommend it. I'll put the location in the description of this video. Okay. She <laughs> said. Oh. Come <laughs> 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 to hug. <laughs> my new uh, Taiwanese mother and father. I'm happy okay. with that. Oh, oh yeah. Wow. <laughs> Shishi, wow. Thank you. Wow. How friendly were those people? Oh my word. Um, the food, <laughs> just delicious. So fresh. Everything was just really light and just crazy delicious. Okay, all for 100 as well. I think she might have given me two dishes for free. Um, the two I didn't order. But amazing experience. I'm going to end the vlog now. I'm going to walk back to my place and just chill. Do some editing, I think. And uh, yeah, just want to say a massive thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video today. This random walk around this random district in Taipei. Have an awesome week. See you soon. Peace out.